What up, everyone? What up? Welcome to our monthly auction, wholesale bulk auction. What? What? Hello. I'm with <laughs> hip and hip flipping mama. What? Oh, that's not my light on. I was like, I'm, I'm just, just being awkward. passive. Just being <laughs> passive. All right, I got my lighting. No, it's it's happening, Melanie, right now. You're in the right place at the right time. Right. Meow. <laughs> so hope everyone is ready to spend some moolah and get some great items. Anthony's got a lot of great stuff. I only got a couple things. Uh, Nathan, are you able to do me a favor real quick? What's up? I type my email into the private chat. Will you put it on like a little banner? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Button? Are you writing everything down, Anthony, or would you like me to, honey? Um, I'll probably do it. So, you don't have to. Okay. So, uh, maybe I'll try just for backup. That would be cool. Um, I'll do my best to keep track. And for everyone who missed the morning show, I almost said our morning show. For everyone, anyone who missed the morning show... You can, and it is available, the Flippin' Hustler t-shirt every day I'm hustling. Bum, 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 I'm being very careful not to move anything. Rev resells in the house. He says, got money and ready to spend. Oh, yeah. I'm ready to sell, so that... Oh, I have to get my cat up. Yeah, um, Melanie Lightbeam says, are you going to explain how this works? Would you like to take that question since you're the auctioneer, Kelly? Yeah, mama. mama Would I it. like to take this question? Okay, I'll get my chat up in a moment. All right, how this is going to work is um, anyone can bid. You're eligible to bid. If you win, you must email Anthony or Nate your real name your youtube name and your address so that they can formally invoice you so it's good to sell send them your paypal email address they'll send you an invoice you pay that invoice and they will send you your goodies everything is free shipping Yep, and since I see Thrift Beast in the chat, um, we will figure out some some way to do international if international people are interested in any of these products. Yeah, if it like if it costs say six ninety nine US, twelve ninety nine, you know, to Canada, we'll just do the difference. Mm -hmm. You know, for international, if there's any international people out there that either that or just split it down the middle if it's more. You know what I mean? We'll, yeah, we'll take care of it one way or another. We'll make it fair. We'll the idea is that you guys. The idea is for you guys to be able to make some money off of some of the stuff we have. Thank you, Susan. I really appreciate that. It's been a it's been a wild ride the last twenty four hours or so. But thank you, thank you. Yeah, we'll we'll find a way, Chris. Thrift Beast. Figure it out, my man. If there's a will, Chris, there's a way, and we'll make that way to Can yep. to Canadian. I, I do so much shipping to Canada, they're not even foreign to me anymore. <laughs> thanks, Paul. Really appreciate that, man. Yeah, thanks a lot, Paul. Uh, Landshark Picker, Alabama is international only if it's shipping to you. So you'd have to pay extra. <laughs> that shipping cost is thirty nine ninety nine. Yep. I got to get it back somehow. <laughs> got to make that money back. But uh, bidding increments is two dollars. Once we hit fifty, it's five dollar increments, and to the end. Uh, make sure you're on live chat. It's going to be by our chat. Um, you know, whoever bid first or, you know, is winning and and we'll try to make sure to uh, give some time in between so that the, the chat, you know, our stream yard and the chat out there in YouTube world kind of, you know, match up. So, you know, if anybody does want to put in a last minute bid, we don't miss them. So whatever you guys will get right? plenty of time between fair warning and sold for that lag. Fear not, but I go fast and furious. So when I start counting something down, baby, if you have any interest, you better be bidding because otherwise it's going to be gone. Thank you, Flipping Crazy. Um, Frank wants to know if there's any update on the beard cups. <laughs> uh, 
Didn't you just suggest them at one o'clock? Yeah, no, no update. I went, I went sourcing real quick after, uh, after all the the lives and everything. So uh, I had to do some shipping, but it'll be in the works. Trust and believe, it'll be in the works. Frank, thank you so much to you and and Uncle B for the shout out and the the wonderful words that you had to say about me during your show. I really appreciate that. That was very nice of you. All right, well, let's get the show on the road. A lot of people are ready to roll. Anthony, we'll let you go first while I get kind of some stuff together. Sounds good. All right, guys. Let's go. I guess first we can do... How many people we got in the house right now, Nate? 21. All right. 21. The bargain, bargain effect's not here yet, is he? Uh, I don't see him. I have a couple of bargain effect specials. All right, so we'll we'll start off a toys lot. Uh, I'm going to start everything off reasonably cheap tonight for you guys. That way, um, you know, the, the goal is to clear out a little bit of space here at the house and also uh, be able to pass on some deals to you guys to make some money. So we'll start off with a toys lot. It's all uh, brand new in box stuff. Um, so it will be, uh, we'll say $15 free shipping to start. Uh, first item is, it's a, uh, Star Wars Lando Calrissian set. Uh, it comes with, uh, a second guy in there and some kind of, uh, machine or droid or something. I'm not entirely sure what's all in there. Next item is, uh, it's kind of like a nerf thing. It's called a Zuru X-Shot. I was selling these things like crazy. Uh, that looks cool. Then I um, I got gated on them. You can shoot people with that. Yep, you can shoot people right in the face if you choose. So, comes with a little Nerf bullets and everything. Um, we got a, Gate City Pickers in at fifteen. Thank you, Gate City Picker. We have a Super Monsters. It's a Netflix. It's kind of like a Funko Pop. Um, only I don't know if this is heavy. This might be metal. I don't, I don't know if it is or not. Don't take my word for the what it's made out of. Let me see if it says. Doesn't really say, but it's like it's like a little bit heavier than the Funko Pop. I would th I would think. Um, I guess it's from Netflix. We have a Dorbs. Um, this is a Marvel Series One Captain America. Oh, he's so little. We have a bit of 15 from Gate City Picker looking for 16. We have this. This is Star Wars Rogue One. Uh, still new in the box. Uh, what was this guy's name? Uh, Cassian Andor. That's and, a nice little toy lot already. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. And if it gets over 25, I'll, I'll throw in uh, another toy. We have a bit of 15 looking for 16. Sand dollars in at 17. Do I see 19? Do I see Anthony? No, I don't. <laughs> Rev resales in at 20. Thank you, Rev. Do I see 22? Hi, Marie. How are you, honey? Oh uh, yeah, PJ Masks. Yeah, it does kind of look like PJ Masks, but it's a uh, Captain uh, America. Hey, Sandy. Well, all those PJ Masks are just baby superheroes. Yeah. Sand dollars in at twenty-two. Do I see twenty-four? At this point, I might as well grab another toy for you guys then. That's the way I can be a man of my word. What will it be? What will it be? I like that great big dude right there. Well, I sold I sold a lot of Rogue One toys. You know, I'll grab you guys another Star Wars toy. Sand Dollar has the high bid of twenty two, looking for twenty four. When it gets to twenty five, we'll throw in this one right here. This is a uh, C three PO. Oh, C three PO's gold now. He's always been gold. Oh yes, he has. You're right. I'm just. I'm thinking. Oh, the, the cool thing about this one is he does have the red arm. I don't know if you can see it there. Oh yeah, he does have red arm. Well, who's the little silver dude? Uh, you're probably thinking of uh. R two D two. Yeah. 
Yeah. Sand Dollar still holds the high bid at 22. Do I see 24? I will start counting it down to Sand Dollar. This guy's in once we hit 25. Okay. We're going to go once to Sand Dollar at $22. Yeah, a lot of nice toys here, guys. Don't let this pass you up. Marie is in at 25. Awesome. I mean, not Marie. Rev is Rev. in at 25. Sorry. Rev, I appreciate that. Rev has the high bid at 25. He's also got the gold <laughs> C3PO. Yep. Did I say it right? Sand dollars in at 26. Do I see 28? Actually, sand dollar at twenty dollars. We go in two dollar increments. Can you make that twenty seven? Murray, I just said your name because I love you so much. <laughs> Dan Dollar's in at 27. Thank you, baby. Do I see 29? Yeah, I might be able to fix something else in there. Let me see what else I can fit in there if we hit over 30. Dan oh, Dollar has the high bid at 27. Rev, do I see 29? I want to keep this with a cubic size. Probably think small enough to fit in there. Hello, Nine Pound Hammer. Nice to see you, honey. Good to see Hello, you. Dana. So we're at 27 right now. There's got to be something else I have small enough. Which toy will he grab? Two Aussie, Aussie thrifters. Hello. Hey, what's up, Brad and or Jazz? Good to see you guys. Hello, Perlini. Perlini. All right, Dan Dollar has the high bid at 27. Rev is out. Thank you, Rev, for letting us know. We're going to go once to Sand Dollar for $27. Nine pound hammer is in at 30. Thank you, Dowden. Appreciate it, man. So now I'm going to be a man of my word and throw another toy in there. Sand Dollar, do I see 32? We'll stick. Since this is all brand new sealed stuff, let's stick with the. Star Wars theme. Ugh, I got another Star Wars. Hammer has it at 30. Do I see 32? Dan Dollar is out. Counting it down for nine pound hammer. Going once for $30. So we'll kick it up since we're at 30 now. This is a uh, Star Wars Episode 1 Tiger Electronics toy that's still sealed. This is from, uh, I think, 99. Sorry, I'm going to throw that in there. Since Thank you, Lynn. Going twice to nine pound hammer at $30. Fair warning. Sand Dollar's back in at 32. What up, Grimes? Thank you, Sand Dollar. Sand Dollar holds the high bid at 32. Nine pound hammer, will you be coming in at 34? Cajun Roots, you are fine. We are on our first lot. You have not missed much. Yep, I can go back through it for anybody that's um, just coming back in. Sand Dollar has the high bid at 32. I'm going to count it down for Sand Dollar going once to Sand Dollar for $32. Oh, she does that. I'll show you guys the stuff again. That's the one I like. Yeah. I can shoot hip flipping daddy. Nate's son so shot twice. him in the face with it when I was at his house last it's time. Sand dollar for thirty-two dollars. Yeah, Hi, right Robert. There. Hey Robert. This is the real cool one right here. This uh Tiger Electronics. Fair warning. What up, Frank? I am looking at the chat. So you guys are getting seven brand new um sealed toys and it is sold for 32 dollars to sand dollar thank you so much ray i appreciate it hello justin how are you my love you can go again anthony yeah 
Actually, let me write this down real quick. So, you don't got one ready, Nate? Uh, yeah, I do. But you you want me to go? I I mean, if you're ready, go for it. I'll just figure let you get a couple since you have more than me. All right. How many we got in chat now? We got forty. Forty. Okay. We got any people like clothing in the house right now? I was trying I haven't to seen Tommy yet. Yeah, that's why I was waiting on Tommy. Okay, so this is a sand dollar box. Okay, we'll do we'll do some books real quick just because I can get them out of the way. So I, there's either 14 or 15 books here. Um, a lot of them are Christian themed, which like if any of you guys sell Bibles or anything like that, Christian themed books do pretty well. Um, a lot of these actually are off my bookshelf because I have like a million and one books. But uh, so first of all, here, some of these are brand new too, by the way. Uh, we're going to start these off at $12. Hello, Cody. $12? Free shipping, yeah. Uh, first book is called The Prayer of Jabez. Uh, it's brand new. The second one is The Prayer of Jabez for Teens. Next book is Run to Win. This is by Christine Kane. She's the uh, associate pastor of uh, Hillsong Church in Australia. Oh. Got uh, Max Lucado, When God Whispers Your Name. That's that voice in your head. Yep. Here's, here's an awesome one, the comic book Bible. It's literally the entire Bible as written in a comic book form. So for that kids cool. or somebody who doesn't like comprehend regular reading really well, or just anybody that's into comics, this thing is super cool. <laughs> Like I, I've actually read through that myself just because I think it's cool. Hey, thanks, Grimes, for sharing this on sharing this on your community post. I really appreciate it, man. Oh, I appreciate that. Um, this is a book called Inside Islam. Uh, this is written from um, an evangelical point of view. Um, it's not necess It's studying um, Islam, but it's from like a Christian perspective. Thank you, Melanie. I appreciate that bid. Uh, this Melanie book, is in at twelve dollars. This book is called Soar. It's by Kenny Luck. I'm pretty sure he's a pastor. This book is from uh, Jeff Leak. He's actually a pastor that I know uh, here in Pennsylvania, um, in Pittsburgh. Actually, it's called God in Motion. Pretty good book. I've read it a couple times. This is called Funded and Free. This is a children's book called God's Creation. This one's called Shepherd's Balm. Um, I guess it's like a story to encourage like pastors or whatnot. Here's a book called Steve Jobs. This bid at twelve dollars. We're looking for thirteen. This is good for like a Bible study. This is a book of Esther. It's like a study guide type book. Oh, nice. Yeah. This one's pretty cool here. This is um, a children's like pop-up book. Oh, nice. It's a biblical pop-up book. This one's like Jonah. and I think it's called Jonah and the Whale. You know, the Bible calls it a fish. But yeah, it's pretty cool. Not sure how much it would cost, Jody. Just depends on where the books are going as to how much it's going to cost. But yeah, I mean, I, if international, for example, man, like I, I would cut you a break on the shipping or whatnot. Um, yeah, within the U.S., it's super cheap because of media mail. Um, here's the last one. This is actually a textbook uh, from Global University. Um, whenever I went through uh, seminary, this was one of the uh, courses I had to take. So in this one, there actually may be like, as you can see, like little bits of like writing or whatever, that kind of stuff. So um, I don't know. I, I just threw it in just because it was sitting there and I've already graduated the class. So I don't necessarily need to take it again. So those are the books. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 14, and 15. 
<laughs> Melanie has the high bid at twelve dollars, looking for thirteen. That is a lot of books, you guys. Fifteen books, free shipping. What up, just me, Kathy? Thanks for coming. Hey, Kathy. And like Betty Webb said, let's share this out. Share, share, share. Sharing is caring. Sharing is caring. We're going to count this down for Melanie here in just a moment. Yeah, we're up at 15. Thanks, Rev. Thank you, Rev. Rev holds the high bid at 15, looking for 16. That's the Lord calling. Yep. Quit selling my books. No. <laughs> <laughs> no. Thank you for passing the word. Yeah. <laughs> what Rev has the high bid at 15, looking for 16. Nate, after this lot, I'm going to have you do one so I can take care of that phone call. Yeah, no problem. We're going to count this down for Rev Resale at $15. Going once to Rev for $15. And Melanie's back in at 16 Thank you, Melody. Looking for 17 Melanie holds the high bid at 16 Looking for 17 Yeah, I'm pretty sure she does, Marie, because mine was uh I didn't see that on StreamYard until she, until Yeah, I've got I've got the YouTube chat up. We're gonna go once to Melody, which I think I already did go once, but we're gonna go twice. Fair warning. Rev is out. I'm looking at the chat, and this is sold to Melody for $16. Thank you, Melody. Yeah, thank you very much. I appreciate it. All right. What do I, oh, yeah, I know what I got. If you have not yet, Melanie, please send Anthony an email with your YouTube name, your real name, and your PayPal email address so he may invoice you. I like that last name, Lightbeam. Yeah, that's cool. What was the winning bid? Sixteen dollars. Sixteen dollars. My chat keeps going away. Hey, Misha. Hi, Victoria. What's up, Cody? Hi, Misha. Hey, Philly Picker. What's up, Joe? What up? Cody, it's so good to see you again. My turn, huh? Your turn, bro. Yes, it is your turn. Make yourself big now. Whoever's whoever won those last two auctions, uh, Jody put up the uh, Anthony's email in the chat. Also, I have it strolling at the bottom of the screen. Uh, and send an email to Anthony with, with all your info, address, uh, name, the lot it was, etc. And uh, Anthony will send you an invoice. Hi, Joyce. Thank you so much for joining us. What up, Joyce? All right, let's go. Let's see what we got. So I got some bags. Book bags. Some bags. There's going to be five total. The first three are going to be new tags. And we'll start this out at 25 bucks. Harry Potter. Oh, I'm going to back up some. We got some backpacks. This one's new with tags. It's got all the different tags on it. That's one. This one is a Game of Thrones. It's new awesome. with tags. That is really cool with all the... That's cool. It's the map of... Uh... I used to study Westeros. Yes. Then we got uh uh oh, what bag is this? Um uh, um oh man five night at Freddy's. This one's new with tags. 
Very nice. Looking for a $25 opening bid. These next two are, are used. Pretty decent condition. This one is a, I believe this is LeBron. I think this is LeBron book bag, I'm pretty sure. It's a little bit dirty, uh, but, it, you know, it's cleaned up nice. It definitely is a nice book bag. There's no sign of any type of, like, wear or Those use. Those are nice colors. But it's a, it's, like, it's a blue and green bag. It's a little bit a little bit dirty on this side, just a little bit. You know what I mean? Not too, nothing too crazy. But it's, uh, it's you yeah, know, really nice book bag. It has all the, it's elite, it says on here. I'm pretty sure that's LeBron's thing. I could be wrong. But it has all like the different pockets for like if you have like a water bottle if you're like using it for sports or anything like that. And then on the inside it has a uh has a pair of headphones. Whoever had this. <laughs> uh, it has a uh like a laptop sleeve inside and then you know just a big compartment. And then this I last bag like is a Nike baseball bag. So this one's for like you know baseball bats, things of that nature. Uh, great condition, nowhere that I could see of. Nice, those are expensive. It's clean. It's not like stinky or anything like you know how some bags get because they're it, you know, used or whatever. It's very clean. Yeah, it is really nice. I mean, fully zips, real nice. It doesn't look like it's ever been used. But these these five. Like I said, three are brand new, and then the other two are used. I'm going to open up these ones for you guys. Looking for an opening bid of $25, please. This one has the laptop thing inside. Oh, nice. And then it also has, it has one of the cup things like or the bottle things on the side. That's a, that's a nice bag wherever you go. And then this one is the Game of Thrones. I like that one. I used to study those maps. To try and see where everybody was in relation to everybody else. This has the same pocket inside. Rev's in it. 25. Thank you, Rev. Looking for 27. This one does not have a bottle on the outside. It, it just has, does have a pocket right here in the middle. Put your, you know, other stuff in it. Hi, Nana Tink. What up, Nana Tink? And then this one, I believe, will be the same thing. It has, well, actually, no, this one has more pockets. This, has, this one has, like, a smaller pocket for, like, keys or something like in it. And then let me open this up wide. Rev Resale has the high bid at 25 looking for a bid of 27 This one has a fancy inside of like the Hogwarts thing. has a really nice padded uh, inside. It has um, one, two, it has two sides for, for bottles or whatever you're putting in here. This one's a really nice one. The three new ones I got uh, at Target. So a really nice, nice bag. Especially this, this is this this uh, Harry Potter one's really really nice. Like it has mad different pockets and the padding inside is like super super nice. So if it would get banged around or anything like that. But like I said, this one's new. There's three new ones. That one's one of them. We have the Game of Thrones with the padded inside. For laptops, no bottle thing on this one. This one just is a little more basic. It has a big pocket here. We got Rev bids thirty. <laughs> He's bidding himself up. Thank you, Rev. Oh, thanks, Rev. This one has a nice pocket inside. This one has, like I said, the the one pocket here, and then the regular pocket there. Then this one has the baseball bag vented here. So this I way, can't believe how clean that bag is. It doesn't get all stanky. Even on the inside, it was clean. Yeah, it was clean. Whoever, whoever had this took care of it. 
Whoever had that probably used it for inside practice. It must be either that or just had their basically just their bats in it. I doubt that bag ever hit a field. There's no way that bag ever hit a field. Yeah. I raised the ball player. I know. Can you have anybody play sports? These are probably like 50, 60 bucks easy. These Absolutely. Rev has a high bid at 30, looking for 32. And then this one's the elite. This one has like the double pockets. This one's like for, for the drinks. Got the little pool thing for it. This one has a zip pocket. And then the inside. It has a laptop one and just a real big opening inside that one. But they're all they're all really clean. Uh, like I said, the only thing that's lit on this one would I would say is oh, I'm hold on. Uh, We're gonna count this down to Rev at thirty dollars going once to Rev resale. I like that Westeros one. Going twice to Rev Resale for $30. Fair warning. And it is sold for $30 to Rev Resale. Congratulations. My email is right there on the scroller. Appreciate that. Thank you. And who's up next? Anthony. All right. So I'm just counting these. I'm pretty sure I have two lots of these. So the way we'll do this is um, I'll start off one lot of these at $15 free shipping. And this is going to be a killer deal, guys, because there's a there's going to be 11 of these in each lot. They're all the exact same thing. So it's multi-quantity listing. Can we make video. Anthony big, please, Nate? Oh, I'm sorry. Oh, yeah. My bad. I thought I did it before. I. There you so, go. It's, it's all multi-quantity listing. We'll start it off at $15 free shipping. They're these little uh, Nintendo 3DS bundles. Comes with like this little uh, like wallet looking thing that has uh, styluses in it, holds games and all that stuff. They're all brand new, sealed, never been opened. Um, so $15 free shipping will be the opening bid on this. And since I have two lots, the winner can either have both lots um, you know, for like double the winning bid, or uh, if the winner doesn't want both lots, then um, whoever was in second place has dibs on buying the second lot for the same price. So those are all the same? Yep. Item. It's all the exact same thing. Um, each lot of them has a total of uh, 11 of these in there, all brand new sealed. Is that a case for... Yeah, That's it's, it's a little case that you can carry your uh, Nintendo 3DS accessories in. Ah, okay. See, I don't know. So I'm not good at those things. Hello, Larry. So each one of the lots has uh, 11 of them in there. Struggle well, luck. Frank is in at $15. Thank you, Frank. Thanks, Frank. Looking for 16 please. I'll tell you what, I don't know anything about video games, but I do like multiple quantity listing. Yeah, they're super easy to list, super easy to ship. Everything about it's simple. That's kind of what I've been looking for with um, this auction is to be able to provide easy, simple stuff for resellers. One listing, multiple quantity. That is what I am about. And that's why I started off so, so uh, cheap is because... I, I want to make sure you guys get deals. Frank is in at 15 stroke of luck looking for 16. This is quite a deal. You guys, this is about a buck a piece. Yep. Yeah. That's a, that's a steal. Yep. Cajun resellers in at 17. Do I see 19? One listing multiple quantity. Free shipping as well. Frank has been at 20. Thank you, Frank. Do I see 22? I hear Nathan puffing on his vape. You know it. And you know this, man. <laughs> it's just the case, Cody. There's no, nothing in the case. It's just. Well, no, I'm pretty sure the case has uh, styluses and stuff in there. It has like a whole bunch of different colored styluses. And then it has spaces in there for the like old games and stuff as well. Oh, that's pretty neat. Yeah. 
So it's it's like a whole little like set. Hold it still for a second. Let me read the. Here, this probably make it easier. Ten styles. Oh, ten styles. Variety of colors plus room for game cards. Nice, you do get the styluses. Yep. So that's what's nice. It's like a whole little pack. Tinjin's in it. Twenty-two. Do I see twenty-four? And it says 3DS on it, but you can also use it for any of the other DS models that you might have, wherever it's at, right there. Because they're the same size cartridge, so it'll be compatible. That is pretty cool. Yeah. And it's uh, if you can see it up close, it's all Super Mario themed. So that just makes it like even better. You know what I mean? It's like official Nintendo style. It's really cute. Yeah. Stroke of luck. Frank is in at 25. Thank you, Frank. Do I see 27? And remember, we do have two sets of these available. Yep. So the winner will have dibs. They can either grab two or somebody else can grab if uh, the winner declines. Someone else can grab it for the same price. Cajun's in at 27. Thank you, Cajun. Other thing, 29. Is the second set exactly the same as the first? Yeah, these are all exactly the same. Okay. Perfect. Set. Perfect. Uh, so it would be one quantity listing for all of them. Perfect. Other thing is uh, with each lot, everybody that wins, I'm going to include a Pittsburgh sticker. I want a Pittsburgh sticker. You're getting one. Don't worry. <laughs> you'll, you'll find out later this week. Aww. Cajun reseller has the high bid at 27, looking for 29. We got 45 in the chat. Thank you so much for being here. Thank yeah. you for coming out, guys. Really do appreciate it. Lynn, whoever wins this, you can hit them up to buy one from them. Look, you even got an Insta sale. Yep. And you got a build in sale, guys. <laughs> Unless you guys decline the second lot, then Lynn, I got you on the on the single. Hey, what's up, Paul? What up, Paul? Oh, a sticker. These are for everybody. If you guys don't buy a lot here, I have them on my eBay store for like two bucks. Like they're like next to nothing. I basically just have enough for them to cover shipping. Cajun reseller has the high bid at twenty seven. I'm going to start counting it down for Cajun. Going once to Cajun Reseller for $27. Thanks, Billy Picker. Really appreciate it. Going twice to Cajun Reseller LL for $27. I thought Larry had a sticker already. I guess not. I got you, Larry. Fair warning. Looking at the chat. And it is sold to Cajun Reseller for $27. Congratulations. Nick, you throw my email back up there for him. Yeah. I uh, thought I'd put it back. I'm slacking. I'm terrible. That's good, man. That 1,000 is getting to his head. You know, yeah. big time now. I just <laughs> need to find a secretary now. <laughs> secretary. <laughs> uh, Cajun, did you want both lots or do you want to put the other lot up for someone else to grab? Completely up to you, man. You get dibs since you won. Dana. At that price, it's almost a shame not to get both. Yeah. So, yeah, you can take either, and then if not, we'll, I guess, first dibs will go to whoever was second place, but then anyone else that would want it, you can just say sold in chat, and you can have it. That is, if Cajun doesn't want them both. Okay, cool. Great. All right, he wants both lots. Good awesome. deal. I'll get them both out to you, man. Good decision. That makes my life a lot easier. <laughs> yeah. I have, I have well, that was a good deal. Like that. that was a really good deal. See, I have a lot of stuff like this that's literally just clogging up space down here that I just don't have room for. So, um, I, I want to start bringing more stuff like this every every time we do one of these auctions. 
<laughs> Cajun seller, Cajun Roots reseller Johnny says, "Oh, by the way, Anthony, the last auction I got from you did not have a sticker in it." Oh, my bad, man. I will. Uh, I'll send you a st uh, sticker. Do me a favor. Uh, send me a private message um, to my email address, and I will send you two stickers: one for you and one for Robert. Well, we can't send them right now because we're holding mail for them right now. But I can give you their information. Oh, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, either way, though, I'll, I'll give you two stickers since I screwed up. Hi, Justin. You missed a, uh, a it was a basically like a case for that had styluses and that you can yep. hold a uh, Nintendo 3DSs on. Yeah, I, I have a bunch of stuff like this. If you guys like this uh, Nintendo stuff, like I buy almost anything I can find Nintendo themed. So if you guys like this kind of stuff, I have other stuff I can pull out. Yeah, Nintendo stuff is pretty gold. That was a good lot. That was a really good lot. So you can go again. You can go again. You want me to go again? Yeah. Okay. We went to whistle. I think I got one, maybe two more lots. I, with Goodwill being closed, it's killed my uh, excess. What I want to know is where the ladies at tonight, mate. I know. I, I have a health and beauty lot. That I, the got ladies I got a closed lot. I'm gonna start this off. I'm gonna start this off cheap too. This is gonna start off. Um, that was my third lot occasion. So that was that uh, was would be the fourth total. Yeah, four the lot four for the night. Well, you can just tell me what it is because I'm not that organized. But this is a health and beauty lot. I'm going to start it off cheap, too, at $15. And this is all brand new product as well. Like, some of the boxes might have, you know, a little bit of wear. Shelf, shelf damage. Exactly. I, I heard Lonnie call it eBay new. So, eBay new? Is that what you said? No, eBay new. You know, because uh -huh. there's like an Amazon new, there's an eBay new, and then there's like a Fleet Market yard sale new. <laughs> <laughs> eBay new. Um, so this one is uh, first thing is Revlon Root Erase, and this is all like health and beauty. I don't know how much any of this stuff is worth, but I know you're gonna get way more. Can you show the top of that box, please? Okay, that's the color. There you go. Yeah, see, I, I'm glad you know this stuff because I don't know any of this stuff. Um, then I have five of these, which has two in them, so there's ten total in five packs. Uh, uh, hold it still. Damage control or damage repairing treatment for the hair. Okay. The hair mask, though. Like I think yeah, hair mask. Hair or something. So there's five of those. Um, they're all, like I said, everything in this lot is brand new. Uh, one of these does have a little bit of uh, wear to the box. The other ones look pretty good. Um, hey, Alan. Nice to meet you. Thanks for coming. See, this in. one right here is cracked, but all the other ones are pretty, pretty good looking. Except for that one that's cracked. Melanie's in at 15. So there's five of those. There's a gray away. Uh, I think this is like a root touch-up stick marker thing. Yep. And is the color up top too? Yep. Should be. That's the color. Lightest brown, medium blonde. Yeah. I got this. Looking to 15, looking for 17. A, beauty mask. Yeah, it's a soothing oh, the eyes. gel beauty mask. For the eyes. Yep. Uh, no pre-registration uh, required, uh, Jam Boltswagon. You just bid, and if you win, then you'll just email me with like your name, YouTube name, and address, and I can send you an invoice. And your resellers in at 17. Thank you. We're looking for 19. Two, two of these. These are can't two. Uh, shea butter. These are like for people that have like dreadlocks. Tea like tree that. and Jehovah. Yeah. Let me bring one a little closer because I'm guessing you probably use this without dreadlocks too. Hair but and scalp oil. Helps protect against breakage. So there's, nice. there's two of those there. And then I have three. Melody is in at 19. Thank you. Looking for 21. I have three of these now. These go along with that. This is like the uh, specialty cleansing cream shampoo. That's the shampoo that is like a conditioner. Oh, okay. It feels like a conditioner. 
but it's supposed to cleanse your hair better than a shampoo. So yeah, they're they're all they're all new. So there's just in the Cantu products, you have five items. Three shampoos. Melanie shampoo, has three the high bid at 19, looking for 21. That's a good lot so far. Yep. So that that's actually the entire 20. We're at two dollar increments now. Do I see 22? You got the two hair product things. You have the root erase and the gray away. So put it all looking back. for a bit of 22. That's a good lot right there. I like those conditioner shampoos. Health and beauty ain't cheap, especially right now. People are looking for everything right now. Did you resellers in at 22 looking for 24? Well, mama does not need the hair color. However, everything else was looking pretty good. Gate City Pickers in at 25. Do I see 27? Hello to uh, Rural Who Stole My Pizza 1 and Jam Volkswagen and also Best Offer Queen. Thank you for coming in. Appreciate you. Cajun Reseller is in at 27 looking for 29. Thank you, Cajun. So, as you guys can see, I'm probably going to need another box to put this in because it's... <laughs> Melody is out. Thank you like for letting us know, Melody. In the box. There should be some pretty good value. I did... Sorry, baby. Station holds the high bid at 27, looking for 29. And Gay City Pickers in at 30. Do we see 32? Anthony, you've got some long arms, and you still can't hold on to that stuff. <laughs> There's just a lot in there. Gay City Pickers holding the high bid at $30, looking for 32. Okay, so I don't have gray hair. I'm growing glitter. <laughs> Thank you for letting us know, Cajun. We're going to count it down to Gate City Picker. Going once to Gate City Picker for $30. Going twice to Gate City Picker for $30. Fair warning. Hello, Dick. I'm watching the nice chat. Thanks for coming in. And it is sold to Gate City Picker for $30. Congratulations. Thanks, Paul. I appreciate it, man. Really appreciate everyone coming in. 49 in the chat. Thank you so much. I'm probably going to I'm gonna do my, my ladies a lot. Do your thing, man. My one I got ladies clothing lot. Mostly going to be LuLaRoe. So if you like LuLaRoe, you sell LuLaRoe, you you will love LuLaRoe. LuLaRoe? What? I have LuLaRoe items and I like them. These are all basically either new or like new condition. I don't I see anywhere on these clothes or anything. No dirt, no nothing. I mean, they feel like they've they basically just been taken off the, the rack or whatever and put in a drawer. So these are all nice clothes. This one is a size large. It's like a like a like a baseball shirt, like a little bit shorter sleeves. Uh, has the like thing bottom to it. Oh, where are we starting this, baby? Uh, we'll do twenty five. Okay. I can't remember how many pieces. I apologize. That's one. This is a, a Victoria's Secret medium sweater. My kids are all having fun upstairs. It's like That's a V-neck. That is home early. So that is two. They're having fun upstairs. They sound like it. They love playing with each other. I love three young kids running around. Uh, this one's a LuLaRoe medium. It's like a, a pencil skirt. Hey, Cliff. What's up, man? What up, Cliff? That's pretty colors. This is a another pencil skirt. It's a medium as well. It has like a, a band or whatever you want to call it. Top. Like a pretty thick one. 
Looking for a starting bid of 25. This is like a, I don't know what type of skirt this is. Merch for Phil. I love hearing that song. That merch for Phil. Yeah. Mom, what kind of skirt is this? That's a knee length skirt. I don't know what LuLaRoe calls the, what the word is for that length of skirt. But the middle a, it goes down to the knee. This one's an extra large. Very pretty. Like I said, these are all like either brand new or worn once like new, basically. This one is an extra, extra small. It's a, your average shirt. Got uh, peacock tails or feathers or whatever. Mm -hmm. Very pretty. Yeah, I like that. This one is new with tags. Row, size extra, extra small. Alan is asking um, how many pieces. Once you're done, you can count through those for him. Yeah. This one's extra, extra small with tags. Oh, that's my size right there. Yeah, mine too. <laughs> extra, extra medium. <laughs> I could use it as my girdle. This is Victoria's Secret size medium. Another uh, sweater, like a V-neck sweater. sweater. So those, I believe, are the only two uh, Victoria's Secret pieces. The rest is going to be LuLaRoe. This is another pencil skirt. has the band on it. Hi, Cliff. How are you, baby? Looking for a $25 starting bid. This is another skirt, another pencil skirt, size Medium. So all the pencil skirts, I think, are medium so far. They mentioned that is two of the same pattern. So you've got one listing, two quantity. Right. This is a long sleeve. Hello, Uncle B. Extra, extra small. I don't know if Lulu the, the opposite it goes, like the sizing. That's an extra, extra small. Nice, pretty, like, uh, like fall leaves on it. Alan is in at 25. Thank you, Alan. And this is a small short sleeve. With a row. Size small. That's a pretty color. And that is it. So we have one. That's a small. Two. Extra, extra small. That's really pretty. Three. Four. Five. This is medium. Uh, Victoria's Secret. We have a high bid of 25. Looking for 27. This is brand new with tags. Extra, extra small. Seven. This is uh, extra, extra small. Eight. This is, I believe, was extra large. Yep, extra large. Nine. This one was a medium, I believe, because I think all the pencil skirts was. Ten. This is another pen skirt. So that one was a, a double up. There's two of them. That one's the same size medium as well. Real easy listing. Boom, boom, bang. 11. Victoria's Secret sweater. Size medium. 12. And a large LuLaRoe. I, I call it like a baseball shirt in men terms. But I don't know what about, what about women. So you got 13 pieces of LuLaRoe. Many new with tags. And we have one bit of $25. I'm looking for $27, please. Yeah, these are, there's there's one with tags. I mean, all of them are like new, like they just took the tags off. I mean, there's no wear, no like, you know, where you're seeing like any type of, of uh, damage to any of the clothing or anything.
Nice lot. Do I see 27? Nobody likes the little row. Uh, what is wrong with my chat? This one's new with tags. I will count this down for Alan Graffius at $25. Going once to Alan for $25. My email, Alan, if you win this, is ticking across the screen. Just going twice to Alan for $25. That is going to be a steal if that goes for $25. Yeah. It's a heck of a lot. Whoever's on Park um, Park eBay, this was good. Oh, yeah, we're small. Fair warning to Ellen at $25. I'm watching the chat. And it is sold to Alan for $25. Congratulations. Thank you, Alan. Appreciate you. You want me to go? Yeah, I got to either find right. another lot or I got to think what I'm doing here. So I, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just go with this one because it's super cool. Lot uh, seven. This is going to be movie theater posters, authentic movie theater posters that are double sided. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do, let's do lots of 10 of them for $20 to start. Um, $20. And I'll have, man, I have so many here. I have enough for at least five lots minimum. So you'll get, like, these are the Peppermint. double sided like legitimate movie theater posters that you would get from the actual theater. Nice. We need to start just, at $20. Yeah. And I'm just going to show you like a sampling of them because there's just so many different ones. Like to be able to narrow down, like each lot's going to have this, this or that, you know what I mean? Like it would just be probably too difficult. Simple favor. That was a good movie. Body and Beta uh, said, just got here. Do we have to do anything special to bid? Send your info and wait to see if we win. No, uh, you just bid. Uh, if you win, you just email the person that, uh, you know, that you won from, which uh, for this lot is Anthony. Yep. You can uh, change the scroll. Nate. That's cool. Yeah, that's Las Vegas Thrifts, right. are, uh, the shipping is free. Are you bidding? Yeah, free for shipping. Power? Free shipping everywhere in the U.S., And if you're outside of the U.S., then we can work something out, like whether we split the shipping or something. You know what I mean? Like, we'll take care of you. That is cool. You can see they're, they're all double-sided. Um, I I literally got every single poster that's in here from the movie theater, um, with the exception of these ones. Where the heck are they? Um if There's going to be 10 in this lot for $20 starting yeah, bid. You'll, you'll get 10 like assorted ones, you know what I mean? Like, for example, um, some of these that I don't have unwrapped yet, like, might have multiples. Like, this right here has a Star is Born, First Man, and uh, Night School by um, Kevin Hart. Um, this one has The Wife... Um, here. Predator. I don't know. If they were the old one. It's probably the new one. It's just nine fourteen, so probably the new one. You got a man cave or a garage? Oh. This would be awesome bedroom. Oh, that would be cute for a kid's room. Small foot. Yep. See, we got Serenity. Flipping flamingos. You having a little one? Hello, flipping flamingos. Thank you for coming in. I got a lot of them. Hey, look, this one right here has a whole crap load rolled together. 
Right. We have the house with the clock in its walls. Okay. And these are these are all the double sided authentic movie theater posts. There's Night School, Kevin Hart, Tiffany Haddish. Um, Man, I think once in a while, you have any Star Wars? Um, I haven't come across one yet. This is pretty cool. Yeah, those are awesome. Operation Finale. Man, those are in good shape. Yeah, I mean, they're most of them haven't been used since they were taken down at the theater. Body in Beta is in at twenty. Thank you. Awesome. And again, since I have so many lots, the winner can have first dibs and have as many lots as they want for the price that they bid. And then from, oh, this is one of the Predator ones. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's that awesome. Cool. That is cool. I'm trying not to damage them. Yeah, that is awesome. If Anthony's chair did not squeak, you guys, it wouldn't have the same personality. Yeah, I'm sorry, guys. I'm very squeaky. The darkest minds. Yeah, you don't get much better than a movie theater poster. No. They're nice and big. And the Las quality Vegas is really good. In at 21. Las Vegas Thrifts, we go in $2 increments at 20. Did I show peppermint already? Can I see 22? Yeah. Did I show that one already? Yeah, you showed so. Peppermint. That was the first one you showed. Oh, okay. That was a great movie. Body Crisis first. holding the high bid at 20. I need to see a bit of 22. Assassination Nation. I'm going to try not to take Thank you, Body and Beta. Detroit 2017. Bad times at El Royale. Body and Beta is in at 24. There's like four of them here. Uh, old Man and Gun, Goosebumps, First Man, Hunter Killer. That so Goosebumps one is probably really, really cool. And if you guys saw this tub that I'm digging through, like this is bathtub size. I could literally lay down in it. That's how big it is. <laughs> Instant Family and Widows. Instant Family is a Marky Mark. Yep. Or a Mark Wahlberg movie. Yep. Body and Beta has the high bid at 24. Looking for 26. Okay. I'm not sure if anyone would have interest in these. Um, I mean, I'll show you guys what they are. But a buddy of mine does a lot of international picking. And he goes to like India several times a year. So he actually brought these back for me one year. These are Indian movie posters from India. Oh. These ones are just like paper. They're not like double-sided like the other ones. These almost feel like a thicker newspaper type print. But I have, I think, four or five um, posters from India too. So Now you get 10 movie posters per lot. Yeah, and it, should you choose to buy a lot and then you see a poster in here you really want, if you let me know, I'll make sure that one gets into whatever lot you get. Or you can choose to purchase two lots. You can purchase up to five because I, I should have enough posters in this tub to build at least five of these ten lots. Body and Beta is holding the high bid at 24 right now. Looking for a bid of 26. Um. You can get these. Uh, here, here's a pro tip. Not all theaters will do it, but some theaters, like if you go in there and you put your name down, they'll uh, give you uh, stuff like this whenever they throw it away or donate it or whatever. So um, my mom lives right next to a theater. So I used to have the hookup with uh, one of the theaters over there. Um, so here's two of the Happy Time Murders and um, what's that say? Simple Favor. We got that simple favor was no simple favor. Thank you for coming in. Appreciate y'all. 
Body and beta holding the high bid at 24, looking for 26. This is, don't worry, he won't get far. <laughs> oh, don't worry, he won't get far on foot is the name of this one, I guess. Looks like it has Joaquin Phoenix in it. Um, the Nun. Oh. Uh, Molly's Game. Kimberly Swartz. Whatever that is. Molly's Game has... Um, oh, I can't think of her name. She's got red hair. Goosebumps, too. The House with Clock in the Walls. I got a lot of the ones with the House with the Clock in the Walls. Oh, this movie was cool. I don't know if you guys seen the Meg that Jason Statham in. Yes, Meg was uh, Yeah, that, thing was, that movie was sweet right there. That was a good movie. Oh, this is a cool movie. Holmes and Watson with uh, Will Ferrell and John C. Riley. That's a newer one. I'm going to start counting this down for body and beta for $24. We're going to go once for $24. Eddie wants to know about the Bollywood. Um, is that separate or... I'll include it as one of the posters if if somebody wants the uh, the Indian posters. Yeah, that's not a problem. Or we can do a separate deal. And let me see how many of them I have. Yeah. We're gonna go twice to body and beta for twenty four. Yeah, you get you get pick up any ten posters if you win. I have six of the Indian posters, so we could either make that a side lot or we can incorporate these six into a lot of 10 other ones. It's completely uh, up to you guys. What's up, Alex? Hi, Hello. Alex. Thanks for coming in, buddy. Always good yeah, to see you. Whatever you guys prefer. Essentially, We're what I'm going to do is twice to body and beta for $24. I'm going to just roll 10 together and stick them in one of these. So that, that's how that's how they're going to go out. Fair okay. warning. Do you have any Marvel ones Texas Bob wants to know? Uh, not that I've seen yet. I I haven't really dug through the whole thing yet, though. Like, this is Alpha. Uh, oh, Eddie came in at just, just before I was getting ready to call it. Eddie is in at 26, looking for a bit of 28. Thank you, Alex. Appreciate it. Another house with a clock in the walls. And he holds the high bid at 26, looking for a bid at 28. These are both the hate you give. Yeah, a lot of really nice posters. And this one's open already. Dark web. Double sided. They're all double-sided, except for the uh, Indian ones. Welcome, Eddie. It's good that you're here. We're happy Glad that you're here, here. Yeah, we appreciate you. Thanks for coming in. Eddie is holding the high bid at $26, looking for a bid at $28. Sure. We love you, too, Alex. Sure. Another one of these Indian ones. I don't know if this is the one I just showed off or not. I think this is a different one. Those Bollywood ones are pretty cool. Yeah, those are pretty cool. Yeah, like I, I don't know what most of these are worth. I would assume they're probably in the bar park somewhere between five and twenty dollars a piece, depending on movie topic or whatever. I know that if you get this stuff framed and matted, it goes up like tremendously in price. Oh, absolutely. So, um, just would depend on which route you go. I mean, it's great for. We're going to count it down for Eddie at $26 going once. What up, D? Nice to see you. Thanks for coming in. Hey, D. Texas Vale, what's up? Going twice to Eddie at $26. Texas Vale said I would be interested in Marvel, Disney, Pixar movies, ones for my game room, family friendly ones. Body and beta, thank you for letting us know. There's a in there. I don't know if that counts as 
family friendly or something like that. Smallfoot is family friendly. It's a kids movie. Yeah, definitely. Fair warning. Those goosebump ones are probably really cool. Yeah, there's a lot of goosebumps. Goosebumps one and two, I think. I'm looking at the chat. And it is sold to Eddie for $26. Congrats, man. Thank you, Eddie. I appreciate that, man. Eddie, please email uh, Anthony. It's on the bottom ticker there. Uh, and you have a choice, too, Eddie. Uh, do you want just one lot, or would you like more than one? Each one would be the same price. And you get 10 in each lot. Yeah, you get the picker poison for of up to 10 and then if you want the second lot you can get another 10 for the same price yep free shipping on everything hello jose what was it uh kelly was it 27 or 26 26 26 thank you yeah those are gonna be awesome and then if anybody else wants a lot you can have it for the same price as uh eddie as well he wants one lot i could probably do at least four more so anybody else wants one you can just type sold and i'll shoot you shoot, shoot me an email for it too what up jose thanks for coming in buddy eddie said he'll take one lot okay thanks eddie i appreciate it anybody else want a a lot for 26 bucks you get second pick of 10 after he picks A lot, of, a lot of great posters. Double sided, really high quality, really big. Great for a Plus game. They're thicker. They're a nice quality. Yeah. yeah. We'll wait a second. See if anybody... No big deal. Like I, I'll have them for next auction, too. So. Dude, I'm going to have to look through those. I, I like I said, there's a lot of them. <laughs> I know, I, I'm probably going to want that, one of those Goosebump ones, man. Because I remember back in the day, I used to collect Goosebump books. Yeah. And, uh, After Anthony sends his lot out, any Sylvester Stallone have my name on it. <laughs> I used to collect Goosebump books and stuff back in the day, so I know the yeah. the graphics on the books were always really cool. So let me see if I can find a Goosebump and I'll show you it. Sylvester Stallone is my boyfriend. Body and Data said, "Sent my info, Anthony." What's that? They sent uh, sent you. Oh, okay, the, thank you so much. I appreciate that. Body and Beta, you were the backup bidder. Did you want a lot for twenty six dollars? What up, Gary? I didn't see you sneak in here. What's up, Gary? Oh, he's been here. Yeah, I'm yeah. sorry, I missed you. Yeah. It must be when I was trying to form a lot. A lot of lots. Hey, Jose. How you doing? Yeah. yeah. Do, you, do you want to show another lot, Nate, or do you want me to show another one next? Go ahead. Okay. I so the, the posters are available throughout. Just tag me or Kelly and say, I would like post a poster lot, and we'll give it to you for that same $26 that Eddie got it for. So that'll remain available. Body and Beta would like one for $26. Okay. Great. Thank you. Appreciate that, Body and Beta. Nice. Thanks, Gary. Really appreciate that. Like I said, if uh, you guys saw anything that we pulled through there that you uh, liked of those posters for the ones that were getting it, you get first dibs on picking through them, whatever you wanted. I agree. I agree, Cliff. Oh, uh, he was he was a mastermind. Who's that? Um, not mastermind, master class, I say, uh, in storytelling. And then his uh, graphics on his book covers are always really cool. R.L. Stein, they're talking. Oh about. yeah, yeah. Okay, so I have a uh, plush lot next, and I'm just gonna start this one off at fifteen dollars. Again, everything's free shipping, guys. So to start it off with, I do have some Beanie Babies. Um, I'll show you which ones are in there. I believe there's 10 total plush here. I think it's half Beanie Babies, half like other type of plush. Um, these all pretty much have tags on them and stuff, the little protectors. 
This one is kicks. Yeah. This one doesn't have a tag, but it's Aaron, the Irish bear. We have, who's this guy? Millennium. He's like the 2000 teddy bear. I have a couple over here. These are like the special. One of them's the Halo. Halo one. It's like an angel. This one is Halo. Same as Halo. Looking for an opening bid of $15. And then the other one is the Holiday Teddy. Aww. Name is just Holiday Teddy. He's like little mistletoes on him and stuff. He has little jingle bells. We have those. We have this uh, Minnie Mouse. Aww. It's like plush, but it's also like kind of a toy. Um, let me see if I can figure out. Doesn't, doesn't she have wheels on her feet? Yeah, like I think she's supposed to walk. Hello, dear. So, turn that back off, though, so the batteries don't die. So, you have that mini Mouse that's like a walking, talking plush. You have this little puppy. Hmm. And, let's see, he's from Animal Adventures. Body and Beta is in at 15. Thank you, Body and Beta. Nana Tink, Body and Beta was just right above you. Can you come in? Then you have a little monkey. And where's he from? He's from Gitsy. Two seventeen dollar bids. Body and Beta comes in at nineteen. Flips comes in at twenty. We go in two dollar increments at this point. Got a Looking large a bid of twenty two. There was a purple one in there, Melanie, but it wasn't the Princess Die one. I think that was like the year 2000 Millennium one. This next one's cool. Watch this, guys. <laughs> if I was a young warthog. <laughs> so, yeah, this is a, it's a puppet. Um, so Ryan Beta's in at 22, looking for 24. Yeah, it's official Disney. Yeah, I just thought that was pretty cool. Thank you, Draw Flips. Is in at 24, looking for 26. Elsa finally finds love here on Every Damn Hustlin'. With the Warthog. <laughs> <laughs> Body and Beta is in at 26. Do I see 28? Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. Body and Beta's holding the high bid at 26, looking for 28. So 10 altogether. That mini just by herself is a good deal. Yeah, I thought that too. So as you can see. We're going to count this down for Body and Beta at $26. Much going once. Going twice to Body and Beta for $26. Fair warning. Ah, draw flips, isn't it? 28. Do I see 30? This was the uh, purple one you are talking about. Body and beta is out. Oh, no, draw flips. Holding the high bid of 28, looking for a bid of 30. That's happened twice to Body and Beta now. Don't wait, guys, for me to say fair warning because that lag can get you. 
We're going to go once to flips for $28. We're going to go twice to flips for $28. She's adorable. Yeah, she is. Melanie says that, that was the millennial bear. Yep. Fair warning. And it is sold to draw flips for $28. Thank you so much. I appreciate that. Oops. I was real, real close there for a second. <laughs> Clicked on myself by accident. It's writing down. That was 28. Yeah. 28. Make sure you uh, send me an email and I will invoice you guys all after the auction. I got, I got a toy lot put together. What's that? So I got a toy lot put together. Okay, you can go whenever you're ready, man. You want to go all right, let's do it. We got seven pieces, uh, all brand new, in package. What are we starting at? 25. Free shipping, of course. PJ Mask, Race Night, Gecko Mobile. We have Chase, little figure. Oh, Paw Patrol. Kids love the Paw Patrol. Trust me, I have enough around the house. We have a Pixar a Mac Transporter. We have Marshall, figure and vehicle. We have Chase, vehicle and figure. We have Cat Car, figure with vehicle. PJ Masks. And for the for the little little ones in your in your life, we have a twisty pet. Aw, Cajun Reseller's in it, 25. Thank my you, Cajun Reseller. My daughter loves these things. Thank Looking you. for 27. I bet she does. That's cute. TJ Masks, Paw Patrol, all this stuff is great stuff to resell. You got little ones. They'll be screaming, I need that, as soon as you open up out of the box. Trust and believe. Asian reseller has the high bid at 25, looking for 27. Nana Tink is in at 27. Thank you, Nana. Looking for 29. Cage your reseller wants to see the twisty pet again. Okay. Resellers in at 29, looking for 31. Hi, Amber. Hi. Violeta. Violeta. Violeta Pony. Oh, Violeta. Oh, sorry. Oh. She's Russian. She's not Russian. She might be Italiano. Yeah. My daughter loves I love those. She still has Nana Tink is in at 31. Thank you, Nana. Looking for 33. Oh, that's cute. So you got all the all the big toy names for for little ones. Cajuns in at 33, looking for 35. Marshall on the double. No, that's rubble. A rubble on uh, what does Marshall say? I don't know. Oh man, she just ruined it for me. We're going to start counting this down for Cajun Reseller at 33 Going once to Cajun Reseller for $33. Don't let the lag get you guys. There's about a 15-second lag. 
Control. Going twice to Cajun Reseller for $33. Fair warning. I'm looking at the chat. And it is sold to Cajun Reseller for $33. Thanks so much, bud. My emails are going across the ticker there. I'll leave it up for a second while Anthony's uh sign up a, a lot. Is this way you can get that up? I'm ready. I got I got my stuff pretty much at my feet already. All right, cool. Okay, so while you do that, um, how many people we got a good bit of people still? 55. Thank you so much. Really appreciate you. Let's do it. We've got quite a few in here from Grimes, too. So thank you, Justin, nice. for sending your friends over. Yeah, appreciate that, Justin. All right, so let's do a uh, Nintendo Wii lot. What are we starting at? Um, we'll start it at 25. So this is, let me see if this is the backward compatible. I thought it was. Maybe it's not. No, the last lot I sold was the backwards. So this is just a regular black Wii. It's not the uh, backwards compatible version. It does come with um, a controller. Um, it also comes with all of the wires, cables, all of that fun stuff. Um, I did include this charging dock with it where you can um, actually charge the controllers. And Jose is in at 25. Thank you, Jose. It does come with one game, which is uh, Super Mario Brothers Wii. So. The only uh, issue I found with it, this is tested and it works. The uh, piece of plastic right here is missing, but it, like I said, it doesn't affect functionality. It still works just fine. But let's see how this kind of works. So it comes with these uh, little. Paul wants to know if you know if they are back compatible. This one I don't believe is. No, this this is not the backwards compatible version. I can check to see if I have a backwards compatible model in, but this is this is the just regular just we. Hunting with triplers in at twenty eight. Thank you, tripler. Looking for thirty one or thirty. I'm sorry. So once you plug the uh, back into the controller, it just kind of sits in here and you can charge it when you're away. Well, yeah, hunting, it's tested. It works. Hunting with Tripler has the high bid at 28. Looking for a bid of 30. Paul wants to know, how do you know if they're back compatible? Um, really easy. Let me see if I have a model that is handy. I might not have any that are, but, um, essentially the backwards compatible ones have the flaps on top, Paul, and you'll see like four controller marks. Uh, and you'll also see another flap that has like a uh, memory card slots. That's backwards compatible to use the GameCube stuff on it. Jose isn't at 30. Thank you, Jose. Looking for a bit of 32. Hello, Hunter Kathy. Tripler's in at 32, looking for a bid at 34. Thank you, Tripler. I'll see if I have an actual case to give you with this, too. This is kind of crazy. I know I have a case somewhere that's at least hard. Better protect this in shipping. Hunting with Tripler has the high bid at 32, looking for 34. Oh, the nice thing about this, too, I didn't notice that until just now. This is the Motion Plus. It's the upgraded controller. So, Cajun reseller wants a recap of what's all included, please. Okay, so it's essentially just a black Wii system. does have a Motion Plus controller. Uh, it also has Mario Brothers Wii. You know, all the normal parts that go to it. And then I'm including a uh, charging dock that comes with two batteries, 
and uh, you know, it's hooked up and everything. Jose is in at 34. Thank you, Jose. Looking for 36. Tripler's in at 38. He says 36. Who needs 36, Mama? I'm going to give you 38. Looking for a bit of 40. We got 60 in the chat. Thank you so much for being here. Jose, thank you for letting us know you're out. Thanks, Jose. Tripler holds the high bid at 38. Looking for a bit of 40. Hello, Lisa C. Hello, hunting with, uh, hunting with Tripler. Nice to see you. We're going to count it down for Tripler. Going once to Tripler for $38. Do not let the lag get you, my loves. Going twice to Tripler for $38. My brother Anthony's thing down there again. It's happened twice tonight where the where just as I'm getting ready to call sold. Fair warning. I'm looking at the chat at see right there. Cajun resellers in at 40. Thank you, Cajun. Thanks, Cajun. Watch out for that lag, you guys. We're going to count it down for Cajun. Going once to Cajun reseller for 40. Looking for a bit of 42. Thank you, Johnny. Going twice to Cajun reseller for $40. Tripler is back in the game at 42. Thank you, Tripler. Looking for 44. We'll count it down for Tripler. Oh, Cajun's in at 45. Thank you, Cajun. Do I see 47? Hey, Source from Paradise. What's up? Tripler's in at 47. Thank you. Do I see 49? Hello, Source from Paradise. Thank you for coming in. 60. Did your reseller is out? Thank you for letting us know. I will count it down for Tripler. Going once for $47 to Tripler. Going twice. For $47 to Tripler. Don't let that lag get you guys. Fair warning. I am looking at the chat. And it is sold to Tripler for $47. Congratulations. Thanks, man. I really appreciate that, Tripler. I'll make sure I get a uh, sticker in there for you. Okay, so the next... Um, I, I got oh, one. You got one? Okay, yep. go ahead. You All right, guys. You guys like Vineyard Vines. I'm your man. You, you got the bug, don't you, Nate? I do. I got that the... Every time you're like, man, I'm going to have like maybe two lots. <laughs> <laughs> um, so I got this all brand new stuff. Um, all vineyard vines. This is a, a dog polo with with the vineyard vines whale. Oh, that's cute. Size medium, brand new. Never, you know, never been out the thing. You don't have just one. You don't have just two. You have three. This one's brand new too. Just got screwed up. Whatever. It just fell out my thing one day it's like thank still, you sourced from paradise i appreciate that compliment i'm sorry this lot is throwing at 25 bucks you get three medium polos all the same size for medium sized dog you also get these beautiful designer uh vineyard vines towels you get one this is one of them oh, those are nice they have a nice beach of one sway to them, you know. Get you get you into some paradise. I like those towels. There's three of these towels. They're kitchen towels, you know, little little. How ones. many towels per set, Nate? Is it a there's, set two? Yeah, there's two towels in each set. So each set. Okay. Put together, but there's three sets. Okay. So one with just the, towels. 
the uh, vineyard vines well, and then this one got the beach von sway. That is cute. And then also there's two light sets. Now one of them does have a little bit of box damage. Compliments my son. He put his autograph on it, so you get a uh, complimentary signature from uh, uh, Every Damn Hudson Jr. <laughs> So this is this is a one of a kind right here. You don't see anything like this. So there's, there's a little bit of box damage because of the signature he decided to throw on there to this lucky winner. But this is a Vineyard Vines light set. This is great for like patios, porches, bedrooms. I mean, you name it. It's uh, seven and a half. I'm sorry, lighted length, seven and a half lighted. And the total length is ten and a half foot on this strand. You have two strands. And the other one is brand new, no damage, no worries. But they're brand new, never open. All this stuff is brand new in the package with all tags. Uh, really nice stuff. If you got a couple pooches, these polos is where it's at. They got the they got the well. Those are expensive, you guys. Those are yeah. really expensive. I'll, thank I'll you, wait. Frank. Thank you, Frank, and thank you, Paradise. I appreciate you. Those are really expensive because before. We lost Scrappy. We bought him all kinds of clothes to keep his body temperature up. And just one of those would be over $20, the fact that it's Vineyard Vines. Right, Frank? The first the first and only autograph right now from Every Damn Hustlin Jr. Eddie, isn't it 25? Frank, Eddie was just before you, baby. Can I get a 27 from you? Awesome. We like to call him the beard in training. <laughs> he, is. he is like me. Like uh, I tell you what, I, I wanted to really call my firstborn, my first son, Nate Jr., but I decided not to because me and him would share the same birthday and it'd been like too much. But man, my second son, like my youngest son, he's uh he just turned two. He's exactly like me. So it was a it was a perfect choice. Eddie's holding the high bid at 25, looking for a bid at 27. Got that nice beach bond sway. I like those towels. I like that they're not the really super thick ones. These are very nice. These are very de uh, designer-ish. Thank you, Frank. Yeah, I like those. Put them around your windows, outside, on a porch, patio. You got two sets. Or you can resell them. Got the autograph. <laughs> it looks like he tried to draw a well. Or a, is, is that or, on plastic or paper? What the, What's that? The autograph. It's on uh, paper. Paper, on okay. Cardboard. Yeah. And we got the poochies. Alan is in at 27. Thank you, Alan. Thank you, buddy. You got three of them. You know, people are trying to swag out their puppies. You see what the, uh, you know, Paris Hilton and, and the Kardashians are doing. Those are cute. Medium pups. They'll be swagged out with the polos. One listing, multiple quantity. That's what we, that's what we try to do here. We try to give you guys stuff that. You don't gotta do a lot of work once you get it out, you know, out the box. A couple listings, multiple quantities if we can. Good night, Cody. Thanks for coming. Thanks for hanging out, Cody. Appreciate Ellen it. Ellen has the high bid at 27, looking for a bid at 29. I don't know if anybody's here bidding bidding has a, a significant other at home, a wife or whatever. They'll love this beach of bond sword. Those are adorable. You should have did those separate from the dogs. I would have bought the towels. I'm sorry, Mama. That's okay. We're going to count this down for Alan. Oh, Cajun Roots reseller comes in at 29. Looking for 31. Eddie is out. We'll see about that, Eddie. We're going to count this down for Johnny, Cajun Roots reseller, going once for $29. He wants that junior signature. I don't know. He might like the Von Sway. You know what I mean? I like that. I love those towels. 
it gives your uh you know your kitchen or wherever you're going to use that it gives it a nice like beach uh you know flow to it we're all stuck in the house let's pretend we're in paradise right now like, <laughs> yeah, like beach the cajun roots reseller i'm flipping my big mouth right now i don't think my husband thinks he's in uh paradise this is a, he got up from his nap. He's not too happy with me. This is a whale of a deal, folks. <laughs> Fair warning. I am looking at the chat. And it is sold. The Cajun Roots for $29. Thanks so much, Johnny. Thank you, Cajun Roots. Trying to throw my uh, banner up. Shazam. You're not shipping to Johnny yet. Oh, okay. Okay, we're holding off on that. Congratulations, Johnny. You want me to go, Nate? Or you get another one? There you go. Okay. I'm, I'm going to see if I can find another one, you know. Yeah. I'll do a clothing one because I have two clothing ones. So I'll do uh, do one now to kind of break them up. Are we doing 25, baby? Um, started at 20. Started low just 20? to. Okay. Up. I'm sure we'll eventually get up there anyway. All right. Starting bid $20. Okay. So this is really oh. this is, uh, like a pullover zip up of uh, Nautica competition. Nice. This is a XL, so it's a pretty good size as well. There's 10 pieces of clothing in this, too. It's all men's clothing. Are these all pre-owned, or do you have any? Yeah, it, it's all pre these are all pre-owned, from okay. the best of my knowledge. All I, right. I literally just went through and threw a few things together. So um, this one is a Columbia polo shirt but it does have a uh i don't know if this is like a sports other side i thought it was a masters logo at first i don't know what it is um it does say on the side here oh clarkson hockey so that that's a hockey team i gotcha but it is a uh Still, it's a nice polo yeah it's probably like a 90s polo from uh columbia somewhere in that time frame Looking for a $20 opening bid. This is a uh, Calvin Klein. It's like a salmon color, I think. Love that color. Yeah, and it's a size large. So it's a decent size. That's perfect for spring. I don't know if you can see the uh, It's line. textured, too. Yeah. We've got, I am going to massacre this, but I nipped rough. Flips in it 20. <laughs> cool. Thank you. This is pretty cool here. Uh, this is a size large uh, Fila soccer jersey. Oh, that's cute. Yeah. Also too. That's a Fila? Yeah, Fila. It's got like. You're so adorable with your little eyes peeking over the top. <laughs> yeah, all the, all the clothes are in good shape, to the best of my knowledge, from what I've seen. Um, these, these are all death pile clothes. These haven't been like processed into my inventory yet. This is pretty cool. This is a uh, size large uh, pit polo shirt. Is that purple or blue? No, it's blue. Navy blue. Okay, navy blue for Pit Panthers. It's our uh, college team here. Oh, it's Ford Pinto backwards. Oh, that's cool. It is. That'll make it a lot easier to figure out who you are then. <laughs> Ford Pinto backwards flips. This is pretty nice. This is bid at $20, looking for a bit of 22 This is a fairway and green golf shirt. It's really nice uh, pink and white color. That looks like Pima Cotton. That looks like it's soft. It's very soft. Size did I say that was? Size large. They're all they're all pretty much decent prices. 
or I mean, not prices, but uh, sizes. I love how you men try and fold. I'm terrible at folding, so just to be frank, whoever wins this is going to get it perfectly wrinkled stuff. This is a size large. Uh, this is a Marines t-shirt. Hi, Amy. Thanks for joining. Merch for Phil. Merch for Phil. <laughs> Merch for <laughs> Phil. I was about that one item I was telling you about. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to have to go to the store after this. Dude, I need to get my merch fulfilled back up and running. I need to go to the store. This is a browning. Uh, it's pink. It has like a dare, a deer, I should say, logo. Drop Flips has the high bid at $20. Looking for a bid of $22. Alan wants to know where you got these, Nate, or er, Anthony. Where I got these clothes, these clothes here. You yeah. can actually see most of these, and I actually have both of these in videos. Um, the most recent church show I went to, Nate, I got a lot of these clothes at, and I got what I didn't get at that church sale. I bought from Paul Gate City Picker on um, an auction he did. So you can actually trace every single bit of this clothing to YouTube. This is a Nautica size large. That's a nice ship logo on it. That's nice. Alan's in it 22. Flips is in it 24. Looking for a bit of 26. There's 10 pieces all together, guys. Here's another Nautica size large. I like that print. Yeah, I like it too. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry we don't go in penny increments I would need to see a bit of 26 So yeah there's uh 10 pieces all together guys 10 pieces of quality pre-owned merchandise $24 is the high bid from Flips looking for a bid of 26 Oh no, what is that? I don't want to hear that noise. <laughs> Wait, so my padded mailers are delivered? What? Might have my uh, eBay stuff already. Mine came in two days. When did I order that? The first? Yeah, that'd be one day. Today's only the second, isn't it? I ordered it yesterday. <laughs> yeah. I, or, I ordered mine. I ordered mine on the thirty first. I still have this one to use. So we've got uh, flips in at twenty four at the high bid. I'm going to count it down for him. Going once, two, some car flips for twenty four dollars. Ford Pinto. Yeah. Going twice to flips for $24. I thought it was 4D Pinto. <laughs> Fair warning. Yeah, I am looking at the chat. They overnighted my stuff. That's crazy. And it is sold to flips for $24. Thank you so much. Congratulations. We got any NASCAR fans in, in the in the house? Anybody? Looks like um, you just missed it, Alan. I have another uh, lot of clothes that I'll be putting up right after Nate, though, so you'll still have another chance. I always tell you guys, be weary of the lag. Uh, the the lag. Sorry about that, Alan. I got three. Uh, Dale Earnhardt and Dale Earnhardt Jr. diecast cars. Where do we start now, baby? We're gonna start this one at 30 just because they're heavy. Uh, they're definitely pretty thought after. All right, so we got the Bud Action. This is an action, uh, 124 scale stock car. 
Dale Earnhardt Jr. That's what his uh his bud car, you know. Then we have the the uh this is um a rebel, uh Dale Earnhardt, the old man, in the Oreo Goodrich car. Number three. Hold it up higher. There you go, babe. That's the Oreo one. And then I have the Coca-Cola. And this is the Sun Junior. Hold it up, babe. Rebel car. Are they all brand new, Nick? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure. I've never opened these up. I believe I got these... They might, Thanks, have been Amy. they might have been open. Were they still eBay new though? <laughs> I mean, they're, like, still, they're still in the package. They, they might have been open, but I, I mean, they look like they've never been touched really, honestly. Rob, you're killing me with those hamburgers. Mama hasn't eaten today. <laughs> this is Dell. We got two that are Dell Earnhardt Jr. Rub's in at 30. Thank you, Rob. Then we got the Papa with the Oreo. Hunter Kathy is in at 32, looking for a bit of 34. They want hard stuff. It's definitely still good. And then you know Junior. So you got the Earnhardt family and three different cars. I think we can all agree that Dale Earnhardt Sr. changed the world of racing with his death. He his death prevented a lot more tragedies in NASCAR for sure. We've got Flips in at 34, looking for a bit of 36. Hunter Kathy's in at 40, looking for 42. Thank you so much. Lisa, I'd kill for a PBJ right about now. Hunter Kathy holds the high bid at 40, looking for 42. For some reason, my body doesn't feed off its fat. I'm still hungry. We got 55 still in the chat. Thank you so much, guys, for hanging with us. Yeah, we definitely do appreciate it. We're going to be doing these at least once a month. Uh, probably once a month. Probably the first Thursday of every month. Yeah. And, uh, you know, we'll try and bring some really good stuff, especially if we're only going to do this once, once a month. Hunter Kathy has the high bid at 40. I'm going to start counting it down for Kathy. We're going once to Kathy at 40. Jose wants to know how many you have. There's three cars, Jose. Two, uh, Dale Earnhardt Jr., one of the old man, Dale Earnhardt. The Dale Earnhardt old man one is the Oreo one I have here right in my hands. That's the one he died in, isn't it? Uh, to be honest, I'm not a huge NASCAR fan. I got these just, you know, to flip. And just to keep to keep on, you know, I like I like collecting some stuff. Uh, I was gonna hold on to the Earnhardt one, but I said, eh. "Jose is in at forty-five. Thank you, Jose. Looking for a bit of forty-seven. So that's a junior number one. And what was his yeah. other number? Kathy's in at forty-seven. Thank you, Kathy. Looking his other number was eight. Eight. This one was the, the Olympic one, the U.S. Olympic one. Okay. So it's a special edition. This one's an action. The other two Jose are... Jose is in at 50. Thank you, Jose. Looking for a bit at 55. Kathy answers that call. Kathy has the high bid at 55. Looking for a bit of 60. Thank you so much. Those are very nice. Jose answers at 60, looking for a bid of 65. Thank you, Jose. For a bid of 65, Nathan will kiss each one. <laughs> and Kathy is in at 65. Thank you, Kathy. Looking for a bid of 70. Come on, Nate. Give it a little tongue. <laughs> no. He'll make the ink run. You gotta keep it family friendly. He'll make the ink run. No tongue. 
Kathy has the high bid at 65. Looking for a bid of 70, please. Got the Earnhardt family here. What a family they were. Right. A lot of talent in that family. Dale Earnhardt's death is one of those deaths that you remember where you were when you were when you found out. Exactly. And it didn't even look like it was that serious. That was the thing. It didn't look like it was that serious of a crash. We're going to count this down to Kathy. Or excuse, yeah, Kathy for $65 going once. Oh, thank you, Crackers Lockers. I appreciate you so much. Thank you, Rev. I appreciate you guys. Going twice to Kathy at 65. Fair warning. Thanks, Crocker Lockers, man. Appreciate you coming in. Looking at the chat. And it is sold to Hunter Kathy for $65. Thank Congratulations, you. Kathy. You got a nice lot there, Kathy. Definitely. Sorry, guys. Nathan, don't forget to kiss each one. Oh, don't worry. Yeah, that better be a nice long kiss, too. <laughs> Good time to make it perverted. <laughs> All right, so this next lot, I think there's 10 or 12. I don't even know. But we'll just say $12 on this. This is a lot of remote controls. And I'll just kind of show you show you each one. Um, I, I basically buy up a bunch of remotes, and I lift them individually. And uh, these are just death power remotes. So $12, free shipping. Some of them are like, this is direct TV. Like, I don't know how much value is in that kind of thing. Looking for a starting bid of $12. Hi, Tammy. Welcome. We're happy that you're here. This is like a GE. I don't know what that's for. Oh, it must be for like a TV. Feel free to bid. Tammy, all you have to do is email your information to either Anthony or Nate. After you've won an auction, so you don't need to pre-register. They all have their backs, too, in case anybody was wondering. I don't know if you guys do a lot of uh, remotes. I I get a lot of stuff like this at the bins. So, like, I'll, I'll mess with the remotes. If I can get them cheap enough, I'll buy them in bulk. You know who sells a lot of remotes is Reseller Robo. She sells a lot of remotes. Body and Beta is in at 12. Thank you, Body and Beta. Thank you. I appreciate that. I'll give you an accurate count after I show them all. There's a older looking GE one. Or like a VCR or something, if I had to guess. Yeah, because it has the stop, play, rewind, all that. It's probably a VCR remote. Body and Beta has the high bid at $12. Looking for a bid of $14. Kathy, you are looking for Nate's information. It is N-D-Z-I-M-I-E-R-A at gmail.com. This one's uh, brand new. Yeah, Nate's information is actually still scrolling. So. Yeah, she can't read it. Oh, okay, gotcha. Again, that's N D Z I M I E R A at gmail.com. I'll put it in the chat for you. How about that? Now that's customer service. <laughs> there you go, baby. Okay, I lied. I said that there was 10 to 12. There's 13. So <laughs> you guys get 13 remote controls, $12 free shipping. And they fit in this nice, cute little box. 
I'm going to count this down for body and beta at 12. Going up, ah, there's Nana Tink at 14. Thank you, Nana. Looking for a bit of 16, please. Yeah, these are like my favorite things to pull out of bins. You're welcome, Kathy. Yeah, that is very great customer service. Hi, Buffalo Picker. Welcome. Body yeah. Invaders in at 16. Looking for a bit of 18. What up, Buffalo Picker? Thanks for coming in, buddy. Buffalo Picker. I wonder why you picked Buffalo and not Bison. He's probably from Buffalo. Oh, that could be. Um, Nana Tink is back in at 18. Looking for a bit of 20. Thanks, Cajun. Body and Beta is out. I will start counting it down for Nana Tink. Thank you, Beta, for letting us know. We're going to go once, two. Oh, thank you, Dana. We're going to go once, two, Nana Tink for $18. What's up, Glass City Pickers? Good to see you. Looking for a bit of 20. Hello, Glass City Pickers. Nice to Going see you. twice to Nana Tink for $18. Fair warning. Nate, can you throw up my email again? Yep. I am looking at the chat. And it is sold to Nana Tink for $18. Congratulations. Really appreciate that. Wait, do you have a lot? Or you know what? Okay, hold on, guys. Hold, got on. One. Thank you. hold on, hold on. Auctioneer is needing to sharpen her pencil. No worries. The mama says stop. We stop. Thank you. What'd you say, honey? I said, Mama says, stop. We stop because you know why? Because exactly what Nana Tink said. <laughs> rock the auction calling. Thank Hi. you. Thank you, Nana. Thank you, Nathan. You definitely do. All right, guys. I Thank got you, a man. lot of eight polo shirts. Polos. They are all uh, used, but in great condition. Thank you, uh, Lisa. We will start them at 25. There goes whoever was trying to bid on the. Uh, I can't remember who missed out on the polo one. I did. That's a nice one, man. What is that polo? Uh, Greg Norman, uh, play dry medium. Who's Greg Norman again? He's golf he's a golfer. No, I know he's a golfer, but I know he's not the shark. Yeah, he's the shark. He's the shark. Okay. Yeah, that's why he has the. Uh... Rev wants to know if you got his email earlier. I'll check it as soon as we're done here at this. Um... At this lot, we have a uh, Jack Nicholas. That's who I always think is the shark. He's the golden bear. The golden bear. This is a size large. This feels like it's literally like brand new. All this stuff feels really good. It's probably really, Pima cotton. I'm really, uh, I'm really picky when it comes to uh, clothing. This is a hundred percent. Mercerized, mercerized cotton. Feels really good. All right. Next one we got is a Ralph Lauren Polo Extra Large. This one feels the same like the other one, like brand new, really nice. This is a classic fit Extra Large. Black with the white uh, logo. Looking for a bid of $25. You know that mercerized or however it's pronounced? It means they run it through the process twice, so it's extra soft. This is a uh, McKenzie Point golf shirt. Really nice. This is really nice quality. We have an Under Armour um, medium loose fit. Not so far, Tammy. Oh, really nice. Then we have Looking a for an opening bid at twenty-five. 
We have an Adidas. Um, what size is this? Um, extra large. Yeah, extra large. It's like a soccer. Oh, that's cool. Every I like I shirts that have like crests on them. Yeah, every time I get like anything soccer related, it usually flies out. I just this was in the death pile. This is a Nike dry fit polo. Size medium. As you can tell, like all the inside stuff, like the markings and stuff, they're all there. You know what I mean? It's not like this thing has been washed a million times. All these these are like basically like I said, like like new new but gently, gently, gently worn. If worn at all. This is a Columbia uh, size large polo. So you got eight pieces all together. Eight Columbia. pieces looking for a starting bid of $25. Tammy would like to know if you have any manga, comics, Pokemon cards, or pops. I have Funkos. Yeah, I, I actually have all of that stuff, to be honest with you. <laughs> yeah, I might try and do like mangas. I don't think I have any mangas left right now, but I have the rest of it on I'll hand. Do, I'll do a Funko lot after the shirt lot. Okay. So we got the, the Columbia or Columbia. We have the Nike Dry Fit. We have the Adidas soccer one. Extra large. I like that one. Someday I'll be an extra large. We have Under Armour. This one is a uh, medium, loose. We have the McKinsey Point. It's a lot of nice polos, guys, for an opening bid of 25 we have the Ralph Lauren Polo. This one's Can we just polo. give credit to Nate for being a man and pronouncing that correctly? Why well, a lot of people mis mispronounce that? Yeah, they they call it Lauren. Oh, uh, this is uh, Jack Nicholas, size large. No, see, I always get it confused. And last but not least. We have the shark, Greg Norman. Looking for an opening bid at 25, guys. How many do you have total, Nate? Eight pieces all together. It's nice stuff. Any Very nice shirts there. Is it all used or is it all new with tags? It's it's all used, but it, like I said, it's it's honestly r really nice condition. Like uh, it looks like it's gently pre-owned. It looks new. If these honestly had, you know, had tags on, I wouldn't be like shocked at all. Like yeah, you know I mean, just by the feel and everything. Like I'm really picky when it comes to clothes. Body like, and Beta is in at 25. Thank you, Beta. Thank you. Looking for a bit of 27. This has the Disney, uh, you know, little like golf thing, little uh, patch on it. That stuff usually helps, like with the resale value. I sell a lot of polos, so when I find them and they're in great condition, I always grab them up, depending on what brand they are. I don't like grabbing just anything. I'm a picky shopper. But these are all good sizes. Large, extra large, couple mediums. I'm going to count this down to body and beta for 25. Going once to beta for $25. That's my favorite. Yeah, that one is very nice. It's probably my favorite one, too. You get the 25 back just in that first that soccer shirt. Yeah, for sure. Uh, Tracy wants to know what the size is for which which one 
just in general? Are they all different sizes? Yeah, they're either large, extra large, or medium. But most of them are in like the large. Like this one's a large. Uh, I'll try and do it real quick. That one's a large. There's this eight little crazy. This one is a medium. This one is an extra large. Yeah, that thing is sick. This one is a medium loose. Right, the Under Armour. We're going to go twice to beta for $25. This one is uh, large. So a lot of large, extra large. A couple mediums. I tried to make it like a mixed lot. Maybe I should have just kept it one big one. Hello, this Mr. Polo. Skids. This Polo is extra large. Really nice condition. Really soft. The Golden Bear is a large Jack Nicholas. He's from uh, our area. Yep. And then Alan, got- there's no 5X in this lot. I don't know if the boys have 5X in their inventory. I have 5X in my closet. Yeah. Well, that was the question. <laughs> it's so hard to find like that size because I'm that size too. And I, I look at stuff all the time going close, you know, the thrifting through clothes. And it's like, it's like nearly impossible. And if I do, it just sells instantly. If it's something I'll keep. This one's a medium. We're going twice to beta for 25. I'll make, I'll try to make a lot out of my closet for next uh, auction. I'll bring some big stuff. Large, extra large. Fair warning. Large, medium, extra large. Medium and large. I'm watching the chat. This is your last chance, you guys. And it is sold. The body in beta for $25. That is a steal. Definitely. Thank you so much. Yeah, it's a good deal. I'm going to throw my, uh, my email in the, in the bottom there. While Nate gets his uh, Funkos together, I'll show off my uh, clothing lot, too. All right. And if you guys are interested in comics and stuff, I can put together probably some comics or some cards quickly, too. Um, so this is 10 pieces as well. Most of them are, like, dress shirts, except for two pairs of jeans. Uh, the first Where are we starting at? Uh, we'll start at $20. I want to make sure people get a good deal. We'll start low. Um, so these are Wranglers, but they're... Like I, I don't want to. They're definitely not real tree, but they look like real tree material. If that makes sense, but it's it's by Wrangler, and these are a size forty four by thirty, so they're a decent yeah. decent big size. So Wrangler camo. Uh, shipping is included. Yeah, shipping is completely free. Uh, Penny, I don't think I have any postcards currently. Um, but I can definitely put that down on a list for next time. Um, I don't think I have any like old, old paper. Um, I, I'll put that on the list for next time though. Cause I can definitely get some. I can uh, bring some postcards next time, Penny. Cool. This is a LL bean, uh, 1533. I don't know how to translate that to whatever that would be like size wise. But it's just a nice, like, button-down dress shirt, L.L. Bean, wrinkle-resistant. And again, there's a total of 10 pieces. This is a uh, Timberland size large. Nice. This one's a short sleeve button-up. Oh, no, button down. I never know the difference. Button down is if they have buttons on the collar. Button up if they don't. So, just a nice plain Timberland. Looking for a $20 starting bid. Here's another pair of jeans. These are Lee. These are size 42, 33. So these are a big size as well. We've got a request for some games. Do you mean board games, Tammy, or video games? Probably have both. 
Gary, they have auctions once a month, usually the first Thursday of the month. Yeah, you can you can definitely join us, Gary. Just uh, hit one of us up after the show, and we'll take care of it. Uh, let's see. This one is Izod size double X. So double XL Izod. I like those colors together. Yeah, it's, it's really nice. Makes me want some watermelon. Yeah. There's a really nice pink one. Tammy wants video games. I could probably pull a few video games. Uh, this is a Nautica Double XL wrinkle resistant. Nautica. Yeah. Really nice one. It's like a pink or a salmon or I don't know how to describe it. Uh, yeah, J Johnny, I always have video games. So, I can always pull some. Need be. Here's another. The rest of what's in here are all dress shirts. This is another Izod. Uh, this is a 17, 17 and a half, 34, 35. I don't really, I don't know how to translate that size. I'm sure if they're your clothing seller, you probably know, though. It's an extra large. Oh, is it? Okay, cool. Pretty sure it's an extra large. Yeah, I was going to say, I know most of this stuff is all. Kathy is in it 20. Thank you, Kathy. Looking for a bit of 22. This one is a 17, 17 and a half, 34, 35, same size. And this is a Chaps. These are all in great condition. They are, they're all are all pre-owned, but other than that, they're all in great shape. This one is an Izod as well. Kathy's holding the high bid at 20, looking for a bid of 22. This one is Chaps as well. He'll count them when he's done, honey. There's there's 10 pieces all together. This is a size large. Chaps. One more piece. This is a 17, 17 and a half, 34, 35. So you guys said that was either a large or an XL. I think it's an XL. So there's there's like three or four of that same size in here. And this one is a chaps as well. Flips is in it 22. Thank you, Flips. Looking for a bid at 24. Kathy. And again, you get a. Kathy's in it 24. 10 total items. Looking for a bit of 26. All pretty decent names. Kathy holds the high bid at 24, looking for a bid at 26. I'm going to start calling this down for Kathy, going once at 24. That's a big bag of clothes there. Yep. Going twice to Hunter Kathy at $24. Fair warning, 
Don't let the lag get you guys. I am watching the chat. And it is sold to Hunter Kathy for $24. Congratulations, Kathy. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. Again, I'm going to throw a sticker in with that. And with every other lot as well. Who, who asked for Funkos? Um, I can't remember. I believe it was Tammy. Tammy, you want Funkos? I got Funkos. This is like a little bit of a, I guess, like a I one Funko I want. A little bit of Easterish lot, you know. Easterish. Yeah. How much are we starting it at, sweetie? We're gonna start at thirty. All right. So, what's Easter without? Oh, there you go. These box conditions are are beautiful. I'm so hungry. I would eat that stinking yeah, thing. They know damage, nothing like that. This came out of uh, a box protector, like a um, like the cinnamon cardboard. So that one is in great condition. This is an Easter themed ultimate unboxing uh, Funko. So it's going to be. You know, whatever is five pieces inside here from what the box says. Uh, so, really awesome piece, thirty dollar value. They say for nine ninety nine. So, you know, this was awesome. But of course, this box is gonna be in good condition. But the goodies are inside, so it's a mystery. We do unboxing videos. It's the ultimate unboxing video. Then we got Aquaman. This is a, a GameStop only at GameStop. It's a, it's a deluxe gym league, so it's very good quality hair condition. You know, box condition is always going to be usually good if you see them for me because I keep good, good care Buffalo of mine. Buffalo Picker is in it 30. Cajun Roots Reseller is in it 32. This then these next two are, 34. Thank you so much. Next two are going to be uh, Star Wars themed. We have uh, Encounter of Endor Movie Moments. Great condition boxes, of course. So very cool. If you're a Star Wars fan, this is definitely up your alley. Check it out for sure. And then last but not least is the rematch of On the Supremacy Star Wars movie moments. That's correct, Kathy. Buffalo Pickers in at 36. Cajun's in at 38. Tammy, we would need a bit of 40. Yeah, there's there's five, five all together. One money, free shipping. Tammy Cajun Roots was in with a bit of 38 before you. Buffalo Pickers in at 40. Now I'm looking for a bit of 42. Johnny's in at 42, looking for 44. Tammy's in at 45, looking for 47. Johnny's in at 47. Give me 49. These are these are perfect timing for Easter, guys. I'll definitely ship us out first thing um, tomorrow. So you get them nice and early for if you got it either for an Easter gift or anything like that. Good night, DV. Thank you so much for your compliments. Thank you, Tammy. Thanks for being here, man. I'll have some sports cards next time. Buffalo Picker, Tammy was in just above you. Can I get a bit of 55 from you? Cajun Roots is out. Thank you, Johnny, for letting us know. Looking for a bid of 55. Buffalo Picker has the high bid at 50. Looking for 55. I'm sorry. Tammy has the top bid at 50. My bad. Tammy's got the top bid at 50. Looking for 55. She just beat you out, Buffalo Picker. These Jim Lee ones are always Awesome, awesome quality. The graphics and stuff, you know, the detail is amazing. Tammy holding the high bid of 50, looking for a bid of 55. Star Wars. Star Wars ones are the, you know, obviously the deluxe ones, big ones, big ones, big bucks. Star Wars stuff is hot. Glass City Picker, thank you for your bid at 50. We do go in $5 increments. Can you please make that 55?
Tammy mm -hmm. is in at 55. Thank you, Tammy. Looking for a bit of 60. These are all, all packed very nice. All good quality. Perfect for a collector, for gifts. Easter is right around that corner. You don't have to leave your house to do it. Tammy's holding the high bid at 55, looking for 60. I love this little peach guy. I know, he's so cute. Oh, girl, I don't know if it's a guy or girl, but I love peeps. When I got them, I'm like, this is going to be great for Easter. I sold so many of them. They're, they're awesome. I'm going to start counting this down for Tammy at $55. Going once. Thank you for letting us know you're out, Glass City Pickers. Going once to Tammy for $55. The counter on Endor. Going twice to Tammy at $55. I see what you're saying, Johnny. Yeah, Tammy would be at 50 instead of 55 because Glass City Pickers bid was not valid because it wasn't in a $5 increment. So we are sitting at $50 for Tammy. Thank you, Johnny, for pointing that out to me. I appreciate you. So Tammy has the high bid at 50. So we need 55, guys. This could be yours. Two big stars. I don't know boys. where I was. I got to start over. Going once to Tammy at $50. Two big deluxe Star Wars movie moments. Awesome pieces. Star Wars. Going twice Jimmy. to Tammy at $50. Jimmy Lee Deluxe. Only at GameStop. Very cool. Amazing art. We got the two Easter. Fair warning. Peeps. Hello, big Texas picker. And the ultimate unboxing box. So you do you I'm watching the chat. This is you. And Tammy, you just bought that for $50. Thank you, Tammy. And Johnny, thank you for uh, catching that for me. I, I totally slipped right by me. Yeah, nice call. Making sure we're all, we want to make sure we're fair and not cheating nobody. So thank you so much. So, um, I just grabbed this lot. This is kind of like a bonus lot, um, just from people asking. Comics, I don't know if you guys want me to open these or not, but I already have these lotted up because I'm pulling these off of eBay. So, um, essentially, I have a lot here of, it looks like, three Twilight Zone comic books. What are we starting at? We'll just start at $15 and work our way up like we have been. Okay. So, um, and free shipping, of course. So, uh, there, what's up, Ash? My wife is uh, joining us from bed. Hello, Ashley. Um, so, yeah, um, there's three Twilight Zone comic books here. Um, the, these are all, like, on card and wrapped. And then I have them polybagged again because they're lotted up currently. I have three of these Convergence comic books. Um, they're like Wonder Woman, the Flash, and like something else. Like I said, I'm I'm willing to open up all of these so you can see them if you'd like. But I know some people might like having them in the lot, so it's easier just for them to sell. So it's up to you. Um, two Adventureland comics. Tammy, you'll send it to Nate. I have three uh, Warrior comics, and this is just like a. Like superhero team type thing, and uh, looks like three GI zo zombie comics all together. So that would be that's five lots of comics, and the total of Tammy Nate's email is scrolling right now, honey. Yeah, thank you, Tammy. So there's 14 comic books all together. And 14 sets? Oh, uh, no, there, there's 14 single books, but there's okay. five, like, 
lauded sets that are like gotcha. comic books. Gotcha. I mean, like guys, these are all only Twilight a, Zone. Only a fifteen dollars starting bid, guys. Fourteen comic books. That's a buck a piece. Yep. And these these are all listed like for around ten bucks in my store right now, and um, I'm running twenty percent off. So you're probably looking at like. Uh, like 15 bucks a lot, something like that. <clears throat> Roughly, if we were going to resell them. <clears throat> There's five of them here. Philly Picker's in at 15. Thank you, Philly Picker. Looking for a bit of 17. Yeah, those are, those are, this should go good, guys. People are home, uh, you know, need something to read. Stuff is flying out of the stores. People are online starting collections than the things that they've never even collected before. People need something to do. Yep. Eddie is in at 17. Thank you, Eddie. Looking for a bit of 19, please. I'm going to go and uh, pull these down while you guys are bidding. Because I actually had two items sold that sold to you guys tonight already. <laughs> Just because I uh, I was in such a rush to do this, I didn't even finish. You say that, uh, 19. Eddie is back in at 21. Thank you, Eddie. Looking for a bid of 23. We are going in $2 increments. Body and beta is in at 23. Thank you. Looking for 25. Fourteen comic books, guys. I'll run through them again for you guys. We do have the convergence, which is Wonder Woman, Flash, and one other one. It might be like Superman or Batman or something like that. Uh, we do have Adventure Time. We have the Warriors, GI Zombie, and the Twilight Zone. So there's a total of 14 comics in five different lots. Eddie is out. Thank you for letting us know. I'll count it down for Body and Beta. Going once to Body and Beta for $23. Okay. Going twice to Body and Beta for $23. Fair warning. Don't let the lag get you guys. I am looking at the chat. And Beta, you bought those for $23. Congratulations. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. What a deal. Throw Anthony's uh, banner up. Come out of lots. You're out of lots? Yes, finally I'm out can, of lots. I can be out of uh, lots too then. So I guess that, that wraps it up, everyone. Thank you so, so much for being here. 44 still in the chat. This is a great auction. That's incredible. Thank you so much, you guys. I'm Quick very, reminder, very... tomorrow morning we're going to do a giveaway on the morning show Ecom Beyond that me and Nate do. Um, I did a vlog the other day. And I mentioned that um, I was giving this away. So if you guys go back uh, to my channel and you uh, comment on that video, just anything about Bob Ross, we're giving away this cereal box tomorrow on the Ecom Beyond Morning Show, 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. You're so. welcome, Eddie. Thank you so much for coming. Yeah, thanks for being here, Eddie. Definitely appreciate every one of you guys being here. Hi, we'll be Robert. If there's anything you guys are looking for specifically or like buying specifically from jewelry lots to, I mean, you name it, just after yeah, this is done, putting it in the comments. So this way we have an idea what to look for because we want to source for what stuff you guys want. So yep. make sure to put that in the comments. And also you get points for this for our morning show for our giveaways that we do. So you get, you get the double, double the pleasure, double the fun with that. So bubble, bubble. 
Yeah, and I'll, I'll drop also, we Nate and I, we have a uh, Facebook group that we do for our morning show, Ecom Beyond. Uh, I'm going to give you guys a link there. If you guys want to go join, um, we keep you up to date with everything that Nate and I do, whether it's, um, you know, the morning show, these auctions, uh, when this whole Corona thing's over with. Uh, <laughs> she wants Disney. <laughs> Once this whole Corona thing's over with, we'll probably be planning another meetup. So all of that stuff um, we discuss in our uh, group. Um, that'd be a good place also for you guys to, you know, if anything pops in your head that you might be interested in getting um, in one of our auctions in the future, you can put that stuff in there as well. But you have questions, you know, you need help with reselling or anything like that, you can feel free to uh, reach out to us in there as well. Dana says congratulations again, Nate. Thank you, Dana. And yeah. don't forget, you guys. Oh, can't get up. I'm so weak from not eating. Every damn hustling t shirts are available online. I'll throw the link for that real quick. Go and get your every damn hustling shirt. <laughs> you can cool. also get your Pittsburgh shirt, too. Yep. Awesome. Any one of my descriptions, guys, you'll be able to find any of my merch that's in there. Also, we have shirts, hats, cups. I want to give a special shout out to, to Mama. She did an awesome job, of course, like yeah, always. Thank you very much. much, Mama. You're welcome, boys. You killed the game. You made me go get lots, Mama. Mama's What's that? Awesome. Mama's auction skills made me go get make some lots and put them together. <laughs> Nate always acts like he ain't going to do no lots, and then he's like, I got a lot. <laughs> the thing that's funny is like I'll, I'll like I'll like sit back and I'm like I don't really don't have anything and the next year it's like you know what I, I could do this one I'll do this one I'll do yeah, this one but you know just kind of at the time when I'm thinking about it I'm like I don't got anything then I see you know how everything's going I'm like wow this is awesome so there's the link for the the merch also got uh, color changing mugs and coffee mugs and stuff too so if t-shirts aren't your thing. There you go. Uh, it's all in my store. Check it out, guys. Thank you so much. Today and yesterday has been just amazing. And, I, you know, without you guys, I wouldn't be here doing this in over 1K. So thanks again. We will see you tomorrow on Econ Beyond on Anthony's channel. And good night. Thank you so much.